my Leashy Toys L6052 quadcopter. It's a Traxxas Alias clone, aerobatic, quick. So it was $30, flies very well. It has a headless mode and uh, it does 3D flips and everything. I'm going to go try and take it for a flight outside for the first time. I've been bashing it around my basement quite a bit. So just give you an idea of what it is, a little 500 milliamp battery. Um, it's kind of got the, the same chassis design as the Traxxas Alias. Very bright lights and um, this is the transmitter that it comes with which is a gamepad controller which is not great for pinchers but it's not it's not too bad actually for uh, for being comfortable. I'm filming this with a Polaroid Cube camera and I'm also going to see if I can get the quadcopter to carry it. So we'll see if that works. A little bit too heavy. Still pretty windy. It's too windy really, but it is fun. Full pout! There's also a very long um, low voltage detection, so I can fly this for quite a while with it beeping. It's a 20 kilometer an hour wind right now, by the way. Let me try and come in for a nice controlled landing. Whoa! There we go. Two, I'm going to use the Dromedo Om Ominous. 700 milliamp battery. Um, it does fit into the quadcopter, although you have to put it in sideways. It's not ideal, but for 200 extra milliamp hours, it's nice. Um, it's a little bit heavier, I guess, but works for me. Immediately a lot more power.
headless mode right now, so it's extremely easy to fly, but it's also brainless. You crash you should spin your prop by hand make sure there's the, no crud got in there because if crud gets in there whoa like like that rear one definitely some some crap in there so they're all flowing free except for this one this one is very very notchy smooth 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 terrible so I guess that's it I got to take this pod apart clean it out so I don't burn out a motor or strip a gear